In this step-by-step -step beginner's guide, I'll help you set up your Amazon Fire TV for the first time so that you can start enjoying your Fire TV without any hassle. First, make sure you have connected your Fire TV to power and inserted the batteries into your Alexa voice remote. After that, let's turn on our Fire TV and you'll see the Fire TV animation. Then we will need to begin the setup process by selecting our language. After that, you'll have to select continue. Don't select store use or it will open in store mode. So let's press continue. And after that, they will ask you to use the Fire TV app. But we are going to select setup with remote and keep it simple. The next step will be connecting to a network. So just select your Wi-Fi name, insert your password carefully, then press the play pause button to connect. After connecting to the internet, your Fire TV will check for software update and download them. Make sure not to turn off your TV while it's ongoing. Next comes the most important step, which is linking your Amazon account to your Amazon Fire TV. If you have an account, then select the first option, or you can also select create a free account. You can also skip this step by pressing the forwards button. But if you skip this, your TV will remain offline and the smart features won't be available. As we already have an account, we're going to choose the first option. We recommend you to go with sign in online and type in the address manually. At the bottom, there's also an option to sign in using the remote, but you'll have to use your phone anyway. So we'll just open a browser on our smartphone and then type in amazon.com forward slash code. Now, if you already have an account added, you can select your account from there or select add account. And most of you will be in this welcome page. If you want to create an account, then you can also select create account. But we will just sign in using our email and password. After that, when it asks for the device code, put in the code that you see on your Fire TV. Then tap on continue and confirm by selecting connect. After that, it will say device connected and you'll see your TV is being registered. To confirm linking your account, you'll need to hit continue. It will ask you if you want to sync your Wi-Fi password. Just select either of these options. In the next step, you'll be able to choose whether you want voice commands when your TV screen is off. As our TV has hands-free Alexa, we will opt in. And for TVs with hands-free, you'll also get this short tutorial and it will show you where the microphone toggle is located. You may also get the overview of motion sensor. Just press got it. Then we're going to skip the Prime subscription pop-up. After that, you can press get started and select the streaming services you want to install. And you can also select no thanks to do it later on your own. Next, you can choose to enable parental controls. We're going to go with no parental controls and we're almost done. Just press got it. Then you can scan for channels if you have the antenna cable connected. And finally, simply choose your profile and now you land on your Fire TV's home screen. So you can jump right into your favorite streaming services and start enjoying your Amazon Fire TV. But to get the most out of your Fire TV and for the best viewing experience, make sure to check out our best picture settings guide by clicking here. And that's how you can properly set up your Amazon Fire TV. Let us know your feedback down below. And if this was helpful, drop a like, consider subscribing, and I'll see you in the next one.